Morning people, uh, it's drive time with Robin and African Payment Solutions. We're ginning up our multinational e-commerce companies for the African markets, just giving them a good idea of how payments are across the African continent. And today, I'm going to talk about uh, kind of comparing South African and Nigerian e-commerce stats, you know, the revenues, users. Uh, the verticals, the internet penetration, average revenue per user, literacy, online payment methods and so on. So to kick off with, uh, Nigeria's e-commerce volumes were projected to be about uh, 5 billion in 2020 as opposed to South Africa's nearly 4 billion. So. When it comes to internet user penetration, South Africa is ahead at 55% and Nigeria is 44%. The estimates are that uh, Nigeria will be up to about 60% by 2020. So Nigeria and South Africa are kind of ne neck and neck when it comes to e-commerce and buying for first position. South Africa is expected to grow at about 7% between 2020 and 2024 and Nigeria 16% only. So um, I'm not sure people have been speculating that Nigeria will take the lead. Um, so yeah, I think that's the way it's going to play out. South Africa's largest e-commerce segment is electronics and media and Nigeria's is fashion. Uh, the average revenue per user in South Africa is around $120 as compared to Nigeria's $50. In general, e-commerce in Sub-Saharan Africa uh, is struggles along, uh, struggles to grow because of poor logistics, you know, the connectivity is expensive, uh, people are not that wealthy. And there is quite a large segment of low-earning rural population. About 40% of Africans live below the poverty line. Uh, and 80% um, of that 40% live in rural areas with limited connectivity. You know, their literacy rates are a lot lower and they have uh, less access to infrastructure. South Africa is very different to Nigeria in terms of it has higher levels of income, the liter literacy rate is almost 100%. Uh, it has very good connectivity, although it's a little expensive, and infrastructure in South Africa is relatively well developed. So, South Africa is one of the most attractive markets for e-commerce uh, in Sub-Saharan Africa. The top markets are Botswana, Kenya and Ghana alongside South Africa and when it comes to connectivity South Africa is the third uh, most internet connected country uh, on the continent. Internet penetration is about 60% and it has probably the highest disposable income and most efficient logistics uh, in sub-Saharan Africa uh, at least which bodes well for e-commerce growth. Those are the factors that would make it really good for e-commerce growth. South Africa is an educated, uh, tech-savvy population. 30% of them are between the age of 20 and 40 and are well positioned to participate in the digital economy. More than half of the roughly 60 million population have access to the internet and South Africa's are quite passionate uh, or they enjoy cross-border shopping. So in terms of e-commerce markets, Nigeria is a little chaotic uh, but has massive potential and South Africa is a slightly more mature market and a lot easier to do e-commerce in. Well that's the roundup for today. So if you are looking for uh, e-commerce payments across Africa, particularly South Africa, Nigeria, Kenya, Give us a shout. We are well connected. We've been in the territory for many, many years, um, almost 20 years actually. So we understand the turf. Uh, we can find a way to get you connected and get you paid in the key territories with the, the most popular payment methods. Well, that's all from me. Have an awesome day and yeah, see you tomorrow.